It's your girl, Denise the Swamp Source. I made it to another, another Friday Souls. All right, everybody. Well, in this Friday Souls, I'm going to share a brief life update with you all. And second, I'm going to show you all what my sewing plans are for the next few days, next few weeks. Just my sewing plans in general, y'all. You know, I don't want to have no WIPs again. So I'm trying my best to do that. So y'all stick around. done so please consider subscribing to my channel so that you do not miss a video or a sales announcement because when i know i will share with you all and welcome new subscribers to the family i truly appreciate you all joining the denise the soft source family thank you all so much first of all i want to say thank you all first of all for commenting subscribing sharing and just being here with your girl for another video now let's get into this friday so first i want to start off with a brief life update then we're going to head directly into my sewing plans because I got to get it. I got to get it moving, y'all, and keep up with these tests. All right. So, first, life update. Well, today when I'm recording this, it is Friday, everybody. I'm glad that it's Friday. It has been a busy week. And your girl over here, for his life, getting ready. My husband has booked us, I'm going to say a brief get away, to go to Charleston. I've always wanted to go to Charleston, y'all. And I'm finally getting the opportunity to go to Charleston next week for the fourth. I'm like, yes! You know, that's just that's just me. I always want to go I'm looking forward to it. So any of y'all been to Charleston? Are there any fabric stores in the area? Look at me cutting my eyes. My husband over here. Tim is over here. So any fabric shops that I should check out while they're affordable, of course, because you know I'm always about saving the money. So y'all let me know. Leave in the comment that area if y'all know about Charleston, any place to go and go shop. And any good good food in the area. You ever been to Charleston? Nice places that you eat. Me that too, y'all. I appreciate y'all. All right, let's get into what's going on. Sewing plans. I'm gonna first start off with Mimi G. Y'all probably be like, Denise, you don't mention Mimi G several times. Y'all know what? I like her simplicity. 98, 94. I have made the crop top and the skirt. Y'all for my project for Make Nine. So y'all stay tuned. Your girl behind. I'm gonna take some pictures of my Make Nine. She is cute. And I made some modifications, y'all. So I'm gonna share that probably in the next video of some of my mates. So I might be in a reel. Just stay tuned. If you subscribe, you won't miss it. I promise you. It should give you a notification when I do. So I am going to use this beautiful black. I shared this in my um, haul. So if you watch my haul, this is the same fabric that I was referring to in my haul. This is a Polytechno that I ended up picking it up from Walmart for $5.17 a yard. I ended up grabbing two yards because I know about two yards for what I could use for this skirt. And I'm actually making view B as in boy. So I already have the top. It is in a corset using this beautiful fabric. Using this beautiful fabric that I have, y'all are trying to grab it for y'all. Using this beautiful fabric here. Oh, y'all see the grommets? I was practicing how to add it so my corset, so I put the ribbing in there. So using this beautiful fabric here, I made her, actually I made a corset, not using this one. Correction. I actually made view number A on Simplicity 9927, but I added straps to it. So I use this fabric to make view A with straps. And it's, and it's a corset style, so y'all stay tuned. I did switch up the back. Instead of a zipper, I actually put grommets in it, and I'm going to add some ribbon to it to tie it. So y'all will never be alone with that Mimi G project number four that I finished. And we say, woo, girl, you're making it. All right, next thing. So this corset with this, with this skirt. And I'm going to use this Polytechno for it, everybody. It has a little sheen. Tyson, my um, youngest and I, we were looking at it. And he was like, Mom, it's kind of shiny. So I was like, that might help it out a little bit because of how it looks. It might give it a little, a little, a little pop, a little flare. I don't know what you want to call it, but it's going to help it out, y'all. It's going to make it cute. Solid black because, as you can see, the 100% cotton fabric is very colorful. 
and I want to break up a lot of that color for me. That's my purpose. So this is the black fabric. Next, and that I'm gonna use that to make you B or the Mimi G. Next up, everybody, it will be for Charleston. Your girl wants some water. I want to go swim in an ocean or somewhere. I just need that little moment of just a little bit of salt water and enjoy, relax, and just we can move on from everything we had going on. I will be using McCall's not, not we start rambling back to the point. I will be using McCall's 7168. Now with this one, I will be creating my own look, but I like the top right here, the little bralette with the flounce. And I will be making like some shorts. Not those, but like some shorts to go with. I'm keen on my like my little shorts at the bottom towards the um bathing suit. That's what I like to do, everybody. So that's my plans for that. And what are you using for fabric, Denise? Well, let me tell you all. I'm going to use this beautiful fabric that I picked up from my local Hobby Lobby doing that 40% off sale. So once again, if y'all subscribe, y'all know I told y'all about that. Yeah, you're missing out. Cute, right, guys? It's going to be red. I'm like, okay, Denise. Ah, I can't wait to make it. Y'all stay tuned. Next, to go along with my bathing suit. It's got to be red. That bathing suit. Cross our fingers. She's going to be ready this. Cross our fingers this weekend. <laughs> Y'all know I so slowly. Next up, as far as my sewing plans, it's Simplicity 9924. What view are you making? Well, everybody, I plan on making view B as in boy. I like that. I have actually some of the material right here, so that'll be really nice. So, view B. That's what I will make using. And I will also possibly make me a little belt to go along with it because i think that'd be nice zipper that i have for it and here is the fabric now if you all watch my previous video you will see that i already mentioned this is some of the things i picked up from hobby lobby haul so that's a part of it last but not least for my sewing plans now i don't know if this one's gonna make it on the list for next week but since it's so hot it may or it may not but when I do make it, I will I will do a reveal for you all to see. All right, the next one. It is another Mimi G. Mimi G. Am I the only one that like Mimi G patterns as well? Who else like them? I know I do. I got like several Mimi G patterns. I love, I love them. So this one's 97.76. I plan on making view. I'm going to go ahead and tell you all now. View A. I think that is so cute. Short sleeve. Off the shoulder. Rock hot weather, you still remain not extremely hot, but you look nice with something lightweight on and flow it. And that's why I'm using this beautiful pink fabric. Now, be aware, I'm gonna tell y'all, this is gonna be an upside. This is a tablecloth. Yes, I thrifted a tablecloth um, way back when, because I don't remember the date, so that's why she go way back when. And who? Oh, Y'all see my face? Can y'all hear my husband? Tell you what he said. Let me, can y'all hear Tim? He said, "You see how little cotton husband and husband." Um, way back when, so he said a few months ago. I almost, I almost say yes. I agree because I do get fabric and let it sit. So this is the cutie that I plan on everybody using for her dress. I think that looks so get the light out so y'all can see. Yes. It does. It's so unique. I like this. I think this is gonna look so cute in view. In view A, everybody. Not a shirt. Oh, it's a dress. Shirt I'm gonna make this a dress. Oh, this is off the shoulder top, and then it's. I'm sorry, y'all. I was talking to him. Uh, oh yeah. Off the shoulder, fat. Off the shoulder top, and um. It's a skirt. So actually it is a skirt, but you're gonna combine it with the elastic and stuff. That's my understanding. Y'all gotta look at the video more to give y'all that detail or whatever. So this is what I'll be using for the fabric. And this is a, oh by the way, another reason why I like it. It looks like it's a probably about one, two, and it has pockets. So it is a easy to sew. That's another thing. Easy to sew. So I need to get the work putting out patterns. The first I need to finish this captain that's sitting on my on my table right now but i want to come on here and do my friday souls i believe this is episode three for you all but i didn't want to miss friday souls all right everybody 
I would like to say thank you all for watching. I hope that you all have enjoy, enjoyed seeing my Friday souls, seeing my song plans, and that you all decide to stick around. If you have stuck around to this end and you have not subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button so you can come on back and see my see my face and see some more items of what I'm working on for is vocabulary. Vocabulary. All right, go edit that one out. See some more hauls, see some more videos, and also you don't miss a sales announcement, everybody. I like to say thank you all for watching, coming, and subscribing to be here with your girl for another one. My motto is keep trying until you get it right. Denise is also bye bye. Check out the sales. I'm putting the link right here. See you all in the next one.